Yo, what up YouTube? It's your boy AM coming to you with another unboxing video. This time we got our special unboxing for you. So when I was walking through Best Buy the other day, I found something really cool that I want to share with you, especially for this unboxing video. So here it, it is. This sucker is a big thing. Whew, it's a massive box. So what it is, is a gaming monitor. This is from Aces, I think that's how you pronounce it. It's a pretty cool thing that I thought I need, I need, I personally need. Um, I like to video game a lot, I like to play games, I play on our bigger TV, but then the problem I'm having with is I'm doing like a lot of streaming, and it takes time to set up my stuff in the living room to start streaming the games, and then I have to take it back down, and then I have to do like unboxing videos, and I don't have enough time to do like all the other videos that I want to do on my channel. And so what I'm going to try to do is set up an area in our apartment that's dedicated to making, um, streaming my games and also doing my YouTube videos. And this is the first step in doing that because I can take my all my video game stations from the main living room to this dedicated area. And then the first step in doing that is getting yourself a good monitor so you can play games on. So I decided to pick this up. It was on sale. It was pretty cheap. So it's 1080p, has two HDMI's, which is great because I want to bring my Xbox over here and then also my PS4, 75 hertz, pretty quick. One millisecond late latency, has game visuals, flicker free, it's great in low light, blue levels, you know, all that good stuff. And then I think it's designed for consoles, which I like because I'm a console player. Um, and so this is going to be the unboxing video of this amazing monitor. Cool. And the important thing is 24, 24 inches. I could have went for probably 27. But the price between 7 and then the 24 was a huge difference. So just to save a little bit of money and a little bit more space, I went with a 24 inch. Because it's kind of like the standard in gaming monitors and things like that. So if you look at this, on all sides you get an idea what it looks like. So here's the top. Just has a handle so you can carry out of the store. On the sides, nothing neat. It says, you know, ASUS in search of incredible. Some warning signs on the side. Right here, some like FCC stuff. Back side looks like the front. Now let's look at the bottom, which is gonna be pretty much probably nothing. So that's basically the box that you come you come with. So what we're going to do is we're going to open this up right now. I think we'll go from the top. Is the best way to do it? Because that's what we have, the whole old opening. So it's taped down. So I got my trusty knife to slice through the tape. And then we're going to start opening this box and see what's inside. The quality of the box is really nice. And I like that. It shows that they kind of value the products. Really thick cardboard. Nice handle for opening that up. Woo! Yeah, so they really protected this sucker big time, so it might be kind of a bit of a stretch for us to pull this thing out. We're gonna try! Hmm. Let me turn on this side where I have a little bit more kind of room to pull. Ooh, that came off. Alright. There we go. Pull that sucker good. Pulling it, pulling it, pulling it, pulling it. <sighs> Big piece of box. There's a lot of stuff in it, it seems like. <sighs> so what we have here, instructions, we don't read that. Nope. Anybody that's into tech, we don't read instructions. We just kind of wing it. <laughs> When it comes to something we don't know, maybe we read the instructions, but for the most part we don't need to read the instructions. Comes with a typical PC audio cable, hook up to your speakers. What we got here, let's see what this cord is. The cord is your typical power cord, pretty dope, pretty dope. Is this an HDMI cord? Let's see. Opening it up, opening them up. Let's see what we have inside. Oh no, it's a VGA cord. That's cool for your PC people. There's also the HDMI cord. It's 
nice they provided one. You know, most times, most techs they don't really provide you one, but it's cool when they do. Um, you can always use a HDMI cord. I'm pretty sure this is pretty good too. What do we have in here? Ah, oh, so we have the power adapter. Provides you clean energy for the monitor. Plug that sucker up like that. And now we got the base. Ooh, the base is pretty cool. Weighted so the monitor won't tip over. Kind of a typical stand. It looks pretty sweet because you just screw it in and then it already connects automatically. And I think you can turn it to whatever way you want it to be. Um, let me see how you do this. Uh, I don't know. I'll have to figure it out a little later. Okay, this is the main crux of our purchase. Ooh, the monitor is encased in pretty good. So that's the stand that connects. It's pretty thick. Kind of like that. Kind of do that. Oh, there's a protector for that. Ooh. Okay, we got this stuff off. Aces logo covered in plastic. Took that off. Now becomes less valuable, as they say. Um, so let's turn this around and see what this looks like. Okay. So this is the product. This is the monitor. Woo, looks pretty good. That looks pretty sexy. We have controls here on the side, just all the features. I think it maybe has a built-in speaker. That's what it looks like. Maybe, maybe not. The stand here is really strong. I like that. Ooh, that turns. So you can go from vertical to, whoops, sorry about that. Vertical to, well, I guess it's landscape to portrait mode. And it stands up like that on your table. Oh, that's cool. So that's kind of it. Everything feels pretty good. It feels doesn't feel like it's made out of cheap plastic. It feels pretty decent. Screen looks cool. Um, in my opinion, I think this looks pretty pretty like a good purchase on my end. I'm pretty happy with it. So that's kind of it for the unboxing video. Um, let's kind of go over some of the features. On the back side, we got two HDMI ports, VGA port, audio, power, things like that. Cool little like. <laughs> kind of like transformer type of iconography in the back. All these like little circuits and stuff to make it look futuristic. It's kind of dope. I really dig it. I like it a lot. Oh, these are buttons right here. Look at this. So let me put on this soft Yu Gi Oh, man. That's why I got it. So I don't scratch my stuff. These buttons here on the back side. You can easily touch them. I think that connects to the, the buttons in the front. And it's pretty cool because you know they could just use standard buttons, but they kind of designed it with the the look of the back of the monitor, you know that transformer look. Transformer, the new transformer, not the old transformer, because the old transformer one looked so futuristic, but the old ones are like more blocky. Oh, pretty dope. Cool, I like it a lot. This little thing back here is really sturdy too. And then the stand is really sturdy too. This thing is super sturdy. So that just slides into here, and then you get to get, you get gaming. Screw on the bottom, screw it in so it doesn't fall out of place. And then you can turn this around to adjust it however you like it. Kind of reminds you of all the specs again here on this little base stand. It's pretty dope. See, there it goes and moves, and then I figure it out. Just got to put a little muscle behind it. Pretty sweet. So let's just stick it on the stand. See how it is. Yeah, slides right in like that. So I'll put it right over here. Yeah, so that's base of basically it for the unboxing video of this gaming monitor. Uh, I have it the plate to really find out if it's worth the money or if it was just you know on sale because nobody liked it. But I think it's pretty dope though. I really think it's pretty dope. Looks like a good quality monitor. I have had some good qualities. I had some poor quality monitors in my day. This one falls into the better looking kind. And all the little things they put, extra things they put into it. The stand is really, it's really heavy, so it doesn't look like it's gonna move around, which is pretty dope. A lot of the times the monitor stands are very flimsy, just a piece of plastic you stick on top, 
you monitor on, you need to have faith in it, kind of like a TV stand. Those little legs, you know what I mean, they hold the TV up, but really they're just pieces of plastic. They don't feel heavy, they don't feel weighted. This thing actually feels really good. The little arm brace feels really good. It feels like you can move it around a lot, it won't break. Um, and, you know, the monitor feels really good. The quality plastic feels really good. It doesn't feel like cheap plastic. You know, sometimes you get those HP monitors and then like, you know, that glossy finish. And if, but it feels plasticky. It feels like, you know, if you drop it once, it'll break. Pretty sure if you did, did this with this, it'd break too. But it, it just feels like it would sit down and fall. But you don't want that to happen. But you want to be kind of like tricked into thinking that if it did fall, it wouldn't break. And this is definitely the type of plastic that makes you think that. So, overall, I think this is a really cool package. I like it. Um, but that's it for my unboxing video. Hope you like it. Like, subscribe, and comment, please. Thank you.